Welcome to now J Crazy News Headlines and a special Monday afternoon to those watching this news broadcast. Now to my viewers and my subscribers. You see, living in the ghetto is not easy. Persons who live in the ghetto can tell you that ghetto life is not easy. Especially the area they live in has constant conflict, constant violence between rival factions and the least little thing kick off a war now three men were shot and killed this morning along bray street in dunkirk st andrew now dead are rick smith aka uncle rick patrick aka uncle shags or shaggy and also mario now based on information the three men were sitting at the corner of Bear Street with other persons when gunmen pulled up in a motor vehicle. Those gunmen came from the vehicle and started firing shots. After the smoke was clear, three men were found swimming from gunshot wounds. They all died on the spot. Now, based on information, this shooting has to do with the internal gang feud in the era between the black street gangs now if you remember last week a man was killed in dunkirk his name is popeye you see on your screen right now now popeye was killed last week by criminal elements in the era however it's alleged that this morning's shooting sparked the reprisal for the killing of popeye which took place last week in the area however the police are saying that they have strong leads into the perpetrators who carried out this morning's attack however you have strong police and military presence in the area so far now i'm going to say this the killing of popeye should have sparked police and military presence in the era from last week because this man who is a influential factor was killed last week and based on information a reprisal was promised so don't know the police did not get that information to actually try to counter the attack this morning however three innocent men were murdered by the hands of criminal elements and now the police is going to drop 48 hour curfew which makes no sense at all because once the curfew is finished the gangs will go at it once again and the fact that this is an internal gang feel between the black street gangs tells it all you see internal gang feel is one of the most dangerous thing to a community in the ghetto can you imagine friends turn enemy friends warn each other that's one of the most dangerous things and sometimes you know these internal gang feud go on for a very long time causing a lot of murders a lot of lives and most times the victims in these internal wars are innocent bystanders innocent citizens of the committee who have nothing to do with the war but because these criminal elements love to go after easy targets they attack citizens who live on the streets that they are beefing with and these law abiding citizens have nothing to do with the war they have absolutely nothing to do with the war however they are killed because of silly conflicts between these gangs internal silly conflicts now patrick was said to be a very well loved and respected man in the community he always used use them to be progressive in the right and proper way do the right thing it's alleged that he also had a store in downtown kingston alleged phone store now he was overseas and he came back to Jamaica recently and see there 
he's now murdered. Now, Patrick, aka Shaggy, wasn't a criminal element. All him love to do is party. It's a party man. Go to party events, dress up in style, and enjoy himself. Residents are upset of the killing of these three men. These three men were known to be men who weren't involved in no war, no beef, but was innocently murdered by these waste men, these serpents, these criminal elements who love to create havoc in this area. Uncle Rick and also Mario was said to be not even involved in any violence but their life was cut short. You see we can't blame the police you know. We cannot blame the police. The only persons who we can really blame is the MPs, the politicians who are responsible for being MPs in these volatile eras. These MPs know who are pulling the trigger but because these MPs and these criminal elements are wrapped up in bed together then these MPs turn a blind eye to the conflict in the communities because these criminal gangs help keep the MP in a position where he's always winning the election for that constituency. These MPs keep these gangs around for election time. Yet they know that these criminal organizations are causing havoc in the area and take a lot of lives. And as far as these MPs know who the gang leaders are but fail to actually hand them over to the police because they feel say or them feel say they won't be MPs anymore. When I tell you that crime and violence in Jamaica is still political, don't take it for a joke. It is very serious. It has been going on for the 80s, 70s, 60s and it's still a continue into 2023. Have you realized that for three weeks straight now, they have been a triple or double or quadruple murder which happened on a Monday to begin the week. When I realize, me don't think when I realize that for almost four weeks straight on a Monday, two persons or three persons or four persons I lose them life one time on a Monday. When I realize that, Monday is not the day where criminals are preferring to actually take more than one person's life. First, it was on the weekends. Now we have moved back to in the week. And Monday is the preferred day to actually commit more than one murders by these criminal elements. May I tell you, we are in deep trouble. Yes, man. We are in trouble, and trust me, this is far from over. This is Jay Crazy. News again. Until then, have a blessed and safe Monday afternoon. Yeah, man, I'm here to see a black legend. I'm here to represent for Jay Crazy YouTube reviewing channel. So, watch, like, comment, subscribe, and share out the thing. Jay Crazy YouTube reviewing channel. We review news and entertainment. Celebrity monster movements are free. Jay Crazy in a play with him and review the thing. Then, Jay Crazy YouTube reviewing channel. We review news and entertainment. Celebrity lifestyle movements are free. Jay Crazy in a play with him and review the thing. Then, Review the thing then, review the thing then Jack Crazy Reviewing news, entertainment and celebrity lifestyle Review the thing then, review the thing then